Um, I am allowed to have a tip jar, so I have a really big bucket up here with um, some tips already because the party's winding down already. I've already served most of the customers. And a good tip to do, a good trick would be to put maybe your own dollar or two in the bucket in your tip jar so that people are prompted to leave tips. This is a cash bar. So I have my cash, my trusty calculator, pen and paper. So I made sure to give him a lot of ones so that he could tip me, but he didn't tip me. It'll happen. You have to just take it in a try. Don't get bitter about it. Be thankful that your tip jar has anything in it. <laughs> I am getting paid hourly, so that's okay. Hourly wages range between $17 to $25 an hour, sometimes more. Um, I had one client that paid me $25 an hour just to bartend, and he did not allow a tip jar, but he did add a 30% uh, tip to everything, and it was all cash every like the same night you worked so you can get really awesome clients like that this is a corporation so this isn't like a regular bartending event that i would do elsewhere so i think catering companies I, i've worked for one cater, catering company that only paid um 13 dollars an hour for a bartender that's really low but you gotta start somewhere. You know, don't say no to it if you don't have anything. Get your experience and look for a better job. So this is a corporation, so they don't um, pay a, a, such a big hourly uh, wage. However, they do allow me to have a tip jar and these people are very generous. So. Thanks for watching. Click the link below to visit our website.